admission process for IITs and IISC in electrical engineering departments. Venkat oh, sir, most you uh, What are the various programs available across institutes are ME, MTech and MSc which is nothing but the Master of Science. IISC Bangalore. IISC Bangalore established in 1909 by Tata's and uh, which is known as Tata Institute. And uh, in electrical department under the ME programs in uh, IISC electrical engineering is there, microelectronic systems which is uh, uh, jointly conducted by EC and CED department, EC and EEE signal processing and EE and CS department is conducting the system science and automation and electronic system engineering, the course name is electronic system engineering and for EE, MSc electrical engineering, for all this one up to first four that is electrical engineering, microelectronic systems, signal processing, system science and automation, the admission procedure, direct admission and who should apply. Generally up to all the rank 50 will get direct admission and for microelectronic system generally the competition is little bit high for direct admission up to all the rank 10. This generally CDT there will be written test conducted by EC and CDT department. This is equally applicable for all EE, EC, IN. So generally the cutoff will be up to all India 10. And for signal processing, all the rank up to 30. Generally not taken by EE, but today in the gate examination, signals and systems also there. Electrical student will get only after clearing the written test and the after the interview. And for EECS, the system and automation up to all the rank 20 direct admission. And for electronic system engineering, up to all the rank 350 this is uh, completely by test and interview so up to 350 or up to 400 also he may call later based on your interview performance you will get the seat and uh, electrical engineering by MSc program which is in IIT and it's called as MS this is completely up to all the 1500 they may call but here if anyone join he has to publish two research papers and the course duration generally will be two to four years and last date for submission online application is March 22nd that is tomorrow and what are the interview tips suggested topics for electronic system engineering test is mathematics analog circuits and digital circuits in mathematics they will expect a good knowledge in the differential equation and you have to prepare complete differential equations not by Laplace transform you should solve the uh, your mathematics uh, differential equation from the fundamental that is particular integral complex integral you should start A to Z and knowledge of mathematics interview question generally based on candidate performance and interview panel generally helpful and uh, apart from this one one student can prepare one particular subject and then in that particular subject you can prepare particular topic and then you can go for the interview in the interview they will ask clearly what topic you prepared and they may ask questions completely based on that particular topic generally for example what is the Nyquist sampling theorem and then that topic they may start and then yeah, they again they will come to the same Nyquist sampling theorem so that it will be contradicted to the initial point in this whole loop you have to find where is the mistake that means you should know the subject completely in all the angles. You have to prepare a small, small derivation, small, small proof completely. And IIT Mumbai. IIT Mumbai is established in 1958. Now we will see what are the courses under the electrical engineering. Under the MTech, power electronics and power systems, control and computing, electronic systems, communication engineering, microelectronics, and under energy science and engineering department energy systems engineering and systems and control engineering systems and control engineering what admission procedure generally id bombay in the first up to all day rank generally 50 to 60 he will give direct admission that is generally for two or three seats remaining all the seats will be recruited by direct admission and who should apply this year he directly mentioned in the website up to all the gate score 600 up to gate score you can apply and you will get interview call for the test and interview and for the energy systems 
same interview and for systems and uh, control engineering direct admission plus test for interview if any student applied as per the priority for electronics for systems and control what and all you applied you have to be prepared for that all the courses because if you apply for power electronics and control they may take for control if you are good in control so who what and all you applied in your application the priority order you have to prepare completely all the subjects and IIT Mumbai last date for submission and the receipt of complete application form is April 2nd and what are the general interview tips test paper generally includes questions from mathematics general aptitude and core subjects the paper has objective as well as subject questions that means they may give an op amp and then they may ask what is the uh, linear application and what is the non-linear application like uh, sorted wave generator and draw a small circuit of the sine solid wave oscillator and suggested topics for interview preparation power systems control systems and power electronics interview questions generally based on the test paper that means what and all you solved in the test the same question they may ask how you solve what is the methodology so while solving also you should solve completely all the steps the interview will be stressed interview like uh, they may ask what if you solve one question how that question you are answering and that and all again you have to show the proof IIT Kanpur era of establishment is 1959 what are the various mtech programs under the electrical engineering department under the mtech power electronics that is power and control microelectronics radio frequency rf and microwave signal processing in uh, id kanpur as like id bombay first few one or two seats he'll give direct interview without interview directly he'll give and uh, remaining seats and all either by test or by interview and uh, up to 400 all day rank you can apply here also like bombay uh, each and every if you apply for microelectronics you should th more thorough in the analog uh, circuits like uh, CE, CB, CC amplifier, MOSFET and JFET and their characteristics what is the input impedance what is the output impedance and the feedback structures and all if you apply for RF microwave you should be more thorough in the inductors and capacitors if you apply for power and control systems you should be more thorough in the power systems and also control systems and if you apply for signals processing you should be more thorough in the DFT, FFT and Fourier transfer, Fourier series and their relation and basic signal characteristics and all. And for ID Kanpur, the last date for online application is April 8th and for receipt of complete application form is April 11th. The general interview tips. Two and a half hour test followed by interview. Test paper generally includes questions from mathematics, general aptitude and core subjects. It is around 60% technical and 40% aptitude and sometimes he may uh, give some more percentage from the gate examination. Suggested topics for interview preparation are mathematics, power systems, power electronics and control systems. In control systems you can uh, especially prepare with root locus and border plots, root which criterion and also Nyquist plot, polar plot and general time response analysis and in power electronics you can prepare for the inverters and the choppers and general SCR capacity and capabilities. They may give a graph and then uh, which may consist of first quarter and current fourth block, fourth quarter and voltage. Then he may ask what is the configuration. That means you can take one BJT and then you have to fit the diode whether across the diode, across the BJT or in parallel in series to the BJT. Yes, but the diagram you have to make the diagrams and all. And in mathematics, uh, you have to prepare mainly for the integrals and linear algebra and calculus. IIT Madras, year of establishment is 1959. In IIT Madras, for electrical engineering students, uh, the courses available are power systems and power electronics, control and instrumentation, and photonics. For power systems and power electronics, you can uh, all the courses in the IIT Madras are direct admission only there is no interview and uh, up to generally all day rank 200 you can apply but generally the cutoff will be 150-200 and uh, there is one more program which is called MS MS by research the program is called MS research this notification will come after the MTech admissions are over this is generally uh, interested students uh, can watch the IIT Madras website they may call uh, for written test and all, generally uh, gate score up to 200, 
will be for direct admission and 300 for the control and instrumentation up to 500 for photo photonics later up to 600 700 they may call for the written test and interview for ms by research you have to publish minimum two research papers the course may take two to four years minimum two years generally it will take four years after the publication of two research papers you are eligible for writing your uh, the ms thesis if you are interested you can continue for phd and uh, this photonics is uh, in the electric department but uh, the subjects more are relevant to the physics and uh, last date for uh, applying online is april 1st last date for receipt of complete application form by post at the gate office april 5th that means you can uh, go and send if you directly you can hand over in the gate office also generally there will be three lists are announced and uh, there is a provision of spot admission after the three years if required iit karakpur iit karakpur is the very oldest iit which is established in the era of 1950 iit karakpur and uh, under the mtech departments the courses available are M uh, machine drives and power electronics that is nothing but the power electronics and power system drives and control system engineering power and energy systems instrumentation signal processing and advanced technology development center embedded controls and software education technology media and sound engineering generally the admission procedure is the interview interview is nothing but he will give one date by that date he will call all the students generally one is to two ratio he will call the students that is nothing but a counseling who where, who should apply last year the cutoff is 679 that is nothing but the 48 marks this year also he may call around like that only and 6.7 is the all-day rank uh, this, uh, this 6.7 is the all-day rank and uh, once you went there based on your choice you can fill the you can take the seats <coughs> for uh, id correct for the last date for receipt of complete application form by post it is april 8th and the interview tubes 70 percent weightage to get performance and 30 percent to interview personal interview Personal interview will uh, test the following motivation and aptitude of the for the program, oral communication skills, sk skills in basic science, skills in basic science, engineering and relevant areas. Okay.
ఐడి ఢిల్లీ ఇయర్ ఆఫ్ ఎస్టాబ్లిష్మెంట్ ఈజ్ నైన్టీన్ అండ్ అండర్ ఎంటెక్ ప్రోగ్రామ్ అండ్ ఎలక్ట్రిక్ డిపార్ట్మెంట్ కంట్రోల్ అండ్ ఆటోమేషన్ పవర్ సిస్టమ్స్ పవర్ ఎలక్ట్రానిక్స్ ఎలక్ట్రికల్ మిషన్స్ అండ్ డ్రైవ్స్ కంప్యూటర్ టెక్నాలజీ అండ్ అండర్ ఇంటర్ డిసిప్లినరీ డిపార్ట్మెంట్ దట్ మీన్స్ అదర్ డిపార్ట్మెంట్స్ విల్ టేక్ ది గెట్ ఈ పేపర్ స్టూడెంట్స్ ఇన్స్ట్రుమెంటేషన్ టెక్నాలజీ వీఎల్ ఎస్ డిజైన్ టూల్స్ అండ్ టెక్నాలజీ ద అడ్మిషన్ ప్రొసీజర్ ఫర్ డైరెక్ట్ అడ్మిషన్ ఆల్ ఇండియా ర్యాంక్ అప్ టు వన్ హండ్రెడ్ టు వన్ ట్వంటీ అండ్ రిమైనింగ్ అండ్ ఆల్ బై ఇంటర్వ్యూ అండ్ ఫర్ పవర్ సిస్టమ్స్ అప్ టు ఆల్ ఇండియా ర్యాంక్ త్రీ ట్వంటీ ఫైవ్ ఫర్ పవర్ ఎలక్ట్రానిక్స్ ఎలక్ట్రికల్ మెషిన్స్ అండ్ డ్రైవ్స్ అప్ టు ఆల్ ఇండియా ర్యాంక్ టూ ఫిఫ్టీ అండ్ ఫర్ కంప్యూటర్ టెక్నాలజీ అప్ టు ఆల్ ఇండియా ర్యాంక్ ఫోర్ హండ్రెడ్ ఫర్ ఇన్స్ట్రుమెంటేషన్ టెక్నాలజీ దట్ అడ్మిషన్ ఆర్ అప్ టు ఆల్ ఇండియా ర్యాంక్ త్రీ హండ్రెడ్ అండ్ వెల్ అస్ డిజైన్ టూల్స్ అండ్ టెక్నాలజీ అప్ టు ఆల్ ఇండియా ర్యాంక్ నైంటీ యూ కెన్ అప్లై అండ్ వెల్ అస్ డిజైన్ టూల్స్ అండ్ టెక్నాలజీ దర్ దో డైరెక్ట్ అడ్మిషన్ ఓన్లీ ఎవ్రీథింగ్ ఇస్ త్రూ ఇంటర్వ్యూ దిస్ ఇస్ మెయిన్లీ టువర్డ్స్ ది అల్లా సర్క్యూట్ బేసిక్స్ అండ్ యూ హ్యావ్ టు నో సీమా సాఫ్ యాంప్ కంప్లీట్లీ అపార్ట్ ఫ్రమ్ దిస్ వన్ ఫర్ దిస్ వెల్ అస్ డ్యూ బికాస్ ద కోర్స్ నేమ్ ఇట్ సెల్ఫ్ ఇస్ సేయింగ్ డిజైన్ టూల్స్ దట్ మీన్స్ యూ షుడ్ హ్యావ్ నాలెడ్జ్ ఆఫ్ ది సి ప్రోగ్రామింగ్ అండ్ సాఫ్ట్వేర్ డెవలప్మెంట్ మెథాలజీ క్యాట్ టూల్స్ అండ్ లాస్ట్ డేట్ ఫర్ ఆన్లైన్ సబ్మిషన్ ఈజ్ ఏప్రిల్ సెవెంటీన్త్ అండ్ సబ్మిషన్ ఆఫ్ చలాన్ ఏప్రిల్ ట్వంటీ థర్డ్ ఫర్ డైరెక్ట్ అడ్మిషన్ మినిమం సెవెంటీ ఫైవ్ పర్సెంట్ బిటెక్ ఆర్ ఎయిట్ పాయింట్ ఫైవ్ సిజిపిఏ ఆన్ స్కేల్ ఆఫ్ టెన్ అండ్ ఆల్ డే ర్యాంక్ షుడ్ బి ఇన్ ది టాప్ హండ్రెడ్ ఇంటర్వ్యూ టిప్స్ నాలెడ్జ్ ఆఫ్ మ్యాథమెటిక్స్ అండ్ సి ప్రోగ్రామింగ్ లాంగ్వేజ్ దట్ ఈస్ ఫర్ క్యాట్ టూల్స్ వీల్ అస్ అటెన్ టూల్స్ అండ్ ఇంటర్వ్యూ క్వశ్చన్స్ జనరలీ బేస్డ్ ఆన్ ది క్యాండిడేట్ పెర్ఫార్మెన్స్ ఇంటర్వ్యూ ప్యాన్ ఇస్ జనరలీ హెల్ప్ఫుల్ ఇంటర్వ్యూర్ ఈజీ కంపేర్ టు ది అదర్ ఐఐటీస్ ఐఐటి గౌతి ఇర్ ఆఫ్ ఎస్టాబ్లిష్మెంట్ ఈజ్ నైన్టీన్ ఎయిటీ ఫైవ్ అండ్ అండర్ ది ఎలక్ట్రికల్ డిపార్ట్మెంట్ ఫర్ ఎంటెక్ ప్రోగ్రామ్ ద కోర్సెస్ అవైలబుల్ ఆర్ సిగ్నల్ ప్రాసెసింగ్ వేల్ ఎస్ఐ కమ్యూనికేషన్ ఇంజనీరింగ్ అప్లైడ్ కంట్రోల్ ఎంటైర్ అడ్మిషన్ ప్రొసీజర్ ఈజ్ డైరెక్ట్లీ త్రూ ఎదర్ ఇంటర్వ్యూ ఆర్ రిటర్న్ బై రిటర్న్ టెస్ట్ అండ్ అప్ టు ఆల్ డే ర్యాంక్ థౌజండ్ స్టూడెంట్స్ కెన్ అప్లై అండ్ వాట్ ఆర్ ద కట్ ఆఫ్ డేట్స్ క్లోజింగ్ ఆఫ్ ఆన్లైన్ అప్లికేషన్ ప్రాసెస్ బై ట్వంటీ థర్డ్ ఏప్రిల్ అండ్ ఇంటర్వ్యూ టిప్స్ ఆర్ జనరల్ అడ్మిషన్ ఈజ్ బేస్డ్ ఆన్ ద టెస్ట్ ఆర్ ఇంటర్వ్యూ కండక్టెడ్ బై ఇన్స్టిట్యూట్ టెస్ట్ పేపర్ మే హ్యావ్ సెవెంటీ ఫైవ్ టు హండ్రెడ్ క్వశ్చన్స్ సజెస్టెడ్ టాపిక్స్ ఫర్ ద టెస్ట్ ప్రిపరేషన్ ఈజ్ గేట్ టూ థౌజండ్ థర్టీన్ సిలబస్ అండ్ బట్ దిస్ ఇస్ జనరలీ ఈజియర్ దాన్ ది గేట్ అండ్ ఐఐటి రూర్కీ విచ్ ఈస్ నోన్ యాజ్ ఎర్లియర్ యూనివర్సిటీ ఆఫ్ రూర్కీ ఇచ్ ఈజ్ ఎస్టాబ్లిష్ ఇన్ ఇన్ ఎయిటీన్ ఫార్టీ సిక్స్ Given the IIT status in 2001. And what are the courses available under the electrical department for M-Tech program? Electrical drives and power electronics, instrumentation and signal processing, power system engineering, systems and control, system modeling and control. The entire admission procedure is tested by interview. But last year, the, I mean up to uh, this year we can apply for up to 800 all-day rank. And last year, the entire seats are filled directly by uh, direct admission only last year i mean last year cut off is 450 the final cut off uh, uh, all day rank and uh, the admission procedure is direct admission only last year there no test and interview but generally they will conduct the test and interview it depends and uh, last date of uploading the field application form by online submission is april 18th and uh, last date for receiving of downloaded and uh, send application form at pg admission office that is nothing but the gate office and all iit rookie is april 23rd and interview tips 70% weightage at gate score and 30% interview admission based on test or interview conducted by the institute this is general as i said last year he given the direct admission iit patna which is established uh, two years back under the electrical department the programs available are mechatronics mathematics and computing nano science and technology up to all day rank 1000 students can apply the closing date of online application form is 15th april 15th last date for receipt of complete complete application form at the iit is 22nd by post and interview performance uh, i mean the cut off tips are 70% weightage to get score and 30% to interview admission based on test or interview conducted by the institute uh, here student can observe all this mechatronics mathematics and computing is uh, towards the i mean you should have the more knowledge of the mathematics 
and uh, programming uh, methodology for nano science and technology this is uh, upcoming uh, subject nano science <coughs> iit bhuvaneswar electrical department the courses available are electronics and communication engineering material science and engineering and uh, the admission process is tested over by interview who should apply up to all the rank 1000 student can apply this is just uh, recently started this iit and uh, what is the uh, methodology of taking 70% weightage to get score and 30% to interview admission is based on test or interview conducted by the institute only two courses available material science and engineering this material science is uh, more or less towards the uh, physics uh, subjects and this electronics and communication is more or towards the communication iit hyderabad and the electrical department power and control which is generally called power systems and control systems and admission procedure is test or interview who should apply up to all the rank 1000 closing date of online application april 15th last date for receipt of complete application forms by id hyderabad april 22nd and uh, what are the interview tips 70 percent weightage to get score and 30 percent to interview admission based on test or interview conducted by the institute iit gandhi nagar under the electrical department only one course which is called electrical engineering and students up to 2009 can apply last day for submitting the application forms is april 5th and uh, here there is no application fee you can uh, give your gate score details and uh, all your credentials and all and then based on your score they will give you offer their seat and generally 70 percent weightage to gate score and 30 percent to interview they may conduct the uh, test and all that is guess 2013 syllabus and if required they may conduct the institute please note that there is no application fee for the iit gandhinagar which is located in the gujarat iit jodhpur which is located in the rajasthan all these new ids are established in two years back under the electrical department the mtech programs are information and communication technology this is more or less towards the com uh, computer science and uh, uh, communication and the energy and system science system science is mainly towards the programming and uh, this energy is more or less towards main core electrical engineering up to thousand older rank you should apply and uh, last date of filling the online application form is april 7th and 70 percent weightage to get score and 30 percent to interview admission based on test or interview conducted by the institute and now we will see the PSUs which are recruiting through get 2013 list of PSUs recruiting through get 2013 power grid IOCL BHEL GAIL DDA NTPC HBCL NALCO and Bell 2013, I mean 2012 and 2013 recruitment statistics are total number of revised number of vacancies 300. In that one for electrical, UR unreserved is 31, OBC is 16, and SC 9 and ST is 4. Total number of vacancies are 60. And we will see what are the cutoffs based on the GATE 2012 score. For electrical, up to all the rank 821. Which, which is around 300 to 400 all day rank and for OBC it is 713 for SC 563 and for ST it is 515 page candidates are shortlisted by accordingly 20% relaxation given in the cutoff of the respect to category and the disciplinary category wise number of shortlisted for interview after the written test and shortlisted for interview electrical unreserved that is 96 and for OBC 50 for SC 29 and for ST 12, total is 187. Now, selection procedure of IOCL. The selection procedure is GD or case study. For case study means they will give one live case and then you have to give your opinion, they will give sufficient time and then you have to think and then you have to give the solution to the case study and later person interview. Last year cutoff is uh, Aldia rank is around 120 and GATE score is 845. Generally, the interview tips are candidates should be aware of company profile, that means the IOCL profile. You can open the IOCL website and then you can read uh, about uh, link, then you will know. Candidates should have in depth technical knowledge and uh, you can have 3 to 4 subjects like uh, power systems, power electronics, electrical machines, and control systems also. 
that means stability criteria and all and uh, you have you should be positioned to explain your BTech project thoroughly and uh, uh, generally they will help uh, so that uh, uh, you have to know one subject completely that means interviewers will not be helpful in general so uh, when they will give a scenario of the question you have to uh, frame the assumptions everything and all you have to get the complete detailed solution NTPC the selection procedure group discussion personal interview and the last year cutoff is around 300 the interview tips are candidate should be aware of the company profile candidate should have in-depth technical knowledge in three to four courses three to four core subjects like suggested, suggested uh, subjects are power systems power electronics electrical machines control systems and you should be thorough with your electrical sub uh, electrical subjects especially in power systems you can uh, prepare for the uh, y bus jet bus load flows and the power system stability of equation uh, alternate current and infinite bus an alternator in parallel to another alternator and uh, fault analysis uh, three phase fault single line to ground fault that analysis completely and in power electronics you should be thorough in the electric uh, drives and uh, inverters choppers and uh, SER uh, capabilities and in electrical machines you should have full knowledge of the DC machines AC machines and uh, weaker inverted weaker and uh, uh, two alternators parallel operation induction motor and uh, in control systems polar plot Nyquist plot stability analysis and uh, you should be in a position to explain your BTEC project thoroughly so you have to prepare and for other PSUs which are introduced recently power grid HBCL Nalco and DDA and Gale for Nalco and DDA there is no group discussion and uh, uh, the selection procedure is GD or K study generally for uh, Nalco and DDA they did not mention group discussion and personal interview will be there expected cutoff this year I will be around all India rank 500 and interview tips are candidates should be aware of company profile uh, not only for any PSC if you are going first they will ask uh, what do you know about our company then you should explain clearly what and all uh, company is doing and what are the their uh, uh, operations and where are they located and the candidate should have in-depth technical knowledge in three to four core subjects like as earlier power systems power electronics electrical machines and uh, control systems also and you should be uh, thorough in your BTEC project. Okay.